relic hunting. Okay, what are we going to play today? Oh my, Surgic Thumb again! Oh, gee whiz! That's pretty fun. Let's get to it. Doing it up commander style with me and my internet friends. Hey, I would love to play first, and I don't have to mulligan this. This is pretty good. Rurik Thar versus Karanos. Oh, another, another god. Relic's been on a god kick lately. Uh, I am the Roll King. Don't inter interpret that as the Fat Rolls. King, please. All right. <laughs> yeah. Last time we played this, I played this. I had a turn to Rurik Thar. It was absolutely disgusting. Uh, I've never seen anything like it. Uh, it won't be happening this game. <laughs> I might be able to get him out turn four. It's possible. Okay. So turn two to get this thing. Well, turn turn four. Yeah, turn four sounds about right. I could probably do a turn four. Let's see what he has. Here's turn two. Turn three, I can eat. I can probably solemn solemn That's the way to do it. Up, oh, so much for that. Turn five, it is, because I will Farhaven Elf and then uh, Golden Gilded Lotus, perhaps. I don't know. We will get a forest. Yes. Thank you. Forest. Yeah, next turn we'll Gilded Lotus, and then we definitely have Rurik Thar on the following turn. And I think that'll be good against Karanos, God of Storms. I think that will be good. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. We got the mana troubles. Now you know how I f uh, how I felt the last few games. Gonna hurt you. I will get some payback on my third god adventure. It's, it perhaps appears like I will anyway. <laughs> Cause uh yeah, Rurik Thar coming down next turn. That's a big deal. That's a big deal indeed. Ooh, ooh, nasty boy. Nasty. Right? That's what I want to do, I think. Let's see what I draw, but I'm pretty sure just Rurik Thar is the play. Yeah, let's do green. I'm not going to waste my eternal witness on the druid. No, I'm not going to do that. We got a uh, counter. Well, it isn't too late then. Eh, who needs the space between late and then? Not this guy. <laughs> no siree. Oh, he done got pongified. I would love an ape. <laughs> Maybe I just let it. Um, <laughs> do I? Yeah. No. I want the ape. And I'll eternal witness the Ruru. <laughs> Why not? What else am I going to eternal witness, huh? He's like, why did he do that? Did he misclick? What's wrong with him? This is this is a sloppy play and I don't recommend it. But I wanted to. I wanted to get value from the Eternal Witness this turn. Since I had the mana open for it. And if I draw another land next turn, then I can do Rorikthar and Solemn Samalakram. And so and Rorikthar only costs six and not eight, as he would if I let the Pongify go. Uh, send Rorik Thar to the command zone. Balls, kill me fast, kind sir. 
It would be my pleasure. Hey, there it is. Rorik Star, just in case he's got the mana leak, we're doing that before the Sol of Solemn Lake Room. And then we will Solemn Solemn Lake Room for, come on, for another uh, another forest, I suppose. Yes. Let's run in there. Hit him for a bunch. Savageborn Hydra will be really gross, too. What a gross, gross card you'll be. Double strike in action. Unless I can just do this. Oh, one, two, three, one, two. Yeah, I can. I can give everybody plus three, plus three next turn, which is probably enough to win. So I guess that's what I'll do. I'll come all fist of crope. Crope a dope. I will kill you next turn if you don't have a counter. So, it, it'll be quick. Ah. Yep, let's do it. Come on, Fist of Krosa. Give everybody plus three, plus three. I think this is enough. I didn't actually do the math, but I believe that's enough. That's a shitload. Yeah, totally is enough. Enough by three, right? Correct! Okay, well, that was a short but sweet relic hunting. Uh, Rurik Thar has fared pretty well against him in general. I mean, not that he could do a whole lot this turn, but I feel like this is a great matchup for Rurik Thar anyway, just because uh, I guarantee there's a lot of instants and sorceries in a Karanos deck. I was too greedy. Yeah, it happens.